welcome back. Today we are going to be doing a fall shopping haul. You guys know that I'm a freak and I'm super excited for fall. I haven't started decorating my house yet, but um, I'm ready. So I have been doing some shopping. So I just wanna show you guys what I have picked up so far. It is kind of limited because a lot of stores don't have their fall decor out yet. And there are a couple things that I wanna pick up like um, certain candies and stuff, but they're not out yet. Yeah, so let me just, let's see. Okay, so um, I did some shopping at Home Goods. I got some more stuff from Bath and Body Works and got something from Party City and also from Target. So let's uh, go ahead and get into the video. So um, I guess let's start with Bath and Body Works products. So they did have another sale that was, I believe it was the hand soap sale this time, which was a five for 25, I believe. So I picked up a bunch of them because I'm a festive girl and I like to have all the fall scents in my house. So let me just show you guys what I got. So the first one I got is the Perfect Pumpkin. And this one is just super cute. And the scents on it are Carved Pumpkin, Spooky Cinnamon, and Moonlight Vanilla. And the next one I got is the Coconut Pumpkin Latte. This one is super cute. And I also got the White Coconut Caramel. Oh, I didn't read the notes on this one. So the Coconut Pumpkin Latte, uh, Coconut Cream Whipped Pumpkin, and Warm Praline. And this one, I believe, no, it's not this one. This one I haven't put out yet. A couple of these I have already put. I have one in my kitchen, I have one in my son's bathroom, and then one in my, um, in our master bathroom. Okay, this is the one I have in my son's bathroom. Okay, this one is the white coconut caramel, and the bottle is super cute. His, I have his bathroom decorated in all white, so it has like a white rug in there, a white shower curtain, white accessories. I love white. White is one of my favorite colors besides pink. So this one, white coconut caramel, just goes perfect in there. And then the top actually has um, like a marble on it. So this was just super perfect for his bathroom. Um, and so this, the notes on it are coconut flakes, toasted hazelnut, and caramel swirl. And that just sounds amazing. Okay, the next one I got, and I think this might be my favorite scent because I did get a wallflower in this scent and that is the pumpkin cupcake it just smells so good and the notes on this one are baked pumpkin whipped vanilla frosting and golden honey i'm telling you guys this one is if you like those sweet smelling scents this is this is a good one the last one that i got and this is the one i have in my master bathroom this is harvest gathering and the notes on this are fresh pick apples autumn berries and clove buds and this one is really cute too. So um, they were also having a buy two get one free promotion on the Bath and Body products. So I did pick up a couple of shower gels and then I obviously got a free body lotion. So you'll have to excuse me. They are missing some already because my husband has gotten into these and I don't actually use these as shower gel we like to take a lot of bubble baths so we like to use these yeah for bubble baths so they make a really good bubbles by the way so if you're into aromatherapy and like relaxation and pampering and like me time this is perfect because this would definitely put you in the mood for fall just the scent that it gives off it's definitely fall scented so um you guys know this is probably one of my favorite scents this is the sweet cinnamon pumpkin and that's the one i told you guys just smells like the epitome of fall for me personally that is how i feel about it so that is the one that i got and i also got the body lotion in this one so i can put it on and smell like fall the notes on this one are heirloom pumpkin autumn cinnamon ginger snap and whipped vanilla so these two are so cute and look at the aesthetic on that and um, if you guys follow me on Instagram I did post a picture of like my bathroom vanity tray and I have them all 
displayed and it's just it's such a mood and yeah so the other scent that I got was marshmallow pumpkin latte and I remember getting this one last year and I also got the body lotion to go with this but honestly this one to me it was a bit much for me I, I used my whole bottle because I'm not wasteful but the lotion it was just it was a bit much for me and the notes on this one are pumpkin latte toasted marshmallow creamy sandalwood and praline musk it does smell really good, but just as a body lotion, I was putting it on and it just like kind of, it's very sweet and it's very, if you're one of those people that's sensitive to smell, it's one of those things that can kind of be overwhelming, to be honest, but I mean, in a shower gel and a bubble bath, yes, I I like it. Next thing that I got were a couple of these wallflowers. So this is a cute little one that I picked up and these ones weren't on sale, but the wallflowers were. So the wallflower plugins weren't on sale, but the actual scents were. I can't remember what the exact price on them was, but it was one of those things where if you buy a certain amount, it's only this amount, and so it is a little bit of money off. So this one, I'm trying to think where I have this one plugged into. Oh, this one is the one that's plugged into my master bathroom. So this is the perfect autumn and it smells really good and it also has an LED light in it so when you plug it into the wall it lights up. This is another one that I got and it is super cute. Um, this is the one that I'm keeping in the kitchen and how cute is that? Oh my goodness it's a little farmhouse and it has little pumpkins on it. It's super cute and then so the scent that I have plugged into this one is pumpkin cupcake and that's the one that I told you guys is just amazing. My kitchen smells like cupcakes and pumpkin, so it's amazing. I really like this one. I did get a couple more. I'm trying to remember the scents that I got. Oh, the one that's in my son's bathroom. That wallflower is just the one that we have in there all the time, and it's a white marble one. But the scent that I got for his bathroom is... Let me wipe this off because I'm dripping the, the oils and everything. The scent that we got for his bathroom is leaves just because I thought it would be something that he liked. So it is a fall scent and it's the one that's called Leaves and it does smell really good, not too overpowering. And then I got another pumpkin apple, which is the one in my candle haul. I told you guys, smells really good. And if you guys go to Bath & Body Works a lot, you know that scent and you know that it's a good one. So pumpkin apple was another one that I got and I wanna say that I got one more. I did, uh, one more is the Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. And to be honest, I feel like that one, that one is in my living room and I feel like that one is not giving off too much of a scent, honestly, but I do have the candle of that one, so that takes care of that. But to be honest, I am a little disappointed with that one in the wallflower version. But that one, I just got just the, the regular basic white plastic wallflower one. I think it was like four bucks because it's kind of in a, in a section where nobody can see it, so... You know, it doesn't really matter if it has a pretty little whatever you call this thing. So I don't know if it's just the plastic one of these that's not allowing the scent to come through. I don't see why it would be that. But honestly, yeah, that one, the Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin Wallflower is a little bit disappointing. I do love that scent, obviously, but um, not having such a great experience with the wallflower for that. Next up, this one is a little bit random but I saw it at Target and I had to pick it up because I'm so extra that even my dish soap has to go with the theme and decor. I did see this at Target and I picked it up. It is the Mrs. Meyers Clean Day Apple Cider Scent and it's like, look at it, it's orange and it's cute and it just looks super fall. And it does say limited edition, so I do believe that this only comes out during fall season. And they do put out like Christmas scents and everything, but I do have a little tray in my kitchen that has my dish soap and Perfect Pumpkin is the one that I have in my kitchen. So I have a white little tray that has this on there. It's just, it's super cute. If you guys want me to do a kitchen tour or a house tour, I can do that. I haven't started decorating yet, but I am going to very soon, probably on the first maybe of September, which actually I, I believe will be Sunday. So I might do that and then yeah, show you guys what I put up so far. But yeah, so this is super cute. I really do like the Mrs. Myers brand. This is the one that I use for my cleaner. I do believe they're all natural ingredients and they don't have, I'm not positive, but I want to say that the Miss Myers brand is one of those 
organic type brands, which is really cool. Next thing that I got was from Party City and I picked this up maybe last week because I was picking up stuff for my son's birthday party who just turned one. By the way, my little Mickey is a whole year old. Yeah, so I picked up this little witch broom because I have been looking for one that I want to hang up or I'm sure you guys saw. I have already hung it up next to the door, which looks kind of weird because I don't have any other fall decor up yet. So there's just a witch broom hanging by my door, which kind of looks weird, but I'm gonna start decorating here pretty soon. So it'll go together, trust me. <laughs> but yeah, so this is super cute. And I got this in the costume section. It was in the witch section. So they have all of the witch costumes and the witch accessories. And they had other ones, but this one was just it was adorable to me. This one, I saw it and I just had to have it. And I, it was very inexpensive too. So moving on to home goods. I'm gonna show you guys what I got from there. Let's start with this super cute bowl. And I need some suggestions because I want to decorate my, I have a coffee bar in my kitchen where I have like my coffee pot and I have just some little home decor things, but I want to make it, uh, this past year actually really has been, ever since I had Mickey, I never used to drink coffee before, but now, I don't know, I don't know if it's because I'm getting older or what, every morning now I have to have coffee in the morning. So before that I used to drink it um, like every once in a while and I would drink it for like the flavor and not for the energy and caffeine but now I definitely need it every morning to wake me up and get me going and yeah I'm getting older and that's just the reality of the situation yeah, so I do want to make my little coffee bar a cute little festive setup so this was the first thing that I got to go there and how cute is this it's kind of like um, a gray color and it says boo on it and that's super cute and I need some suggestions on what to put in here because I'm gonna put it in the corner and I'll give you guys a little tour um, once I get everything together and it, it'll you know look super cute and presentable for you guys but yeah I don't know what to put in here I don't um, I do have a couple jars for candy so I don't think that I want to put candy in here and it is pretty deep um, as you guys can see I'm not sure what I'm gonna put in here so I mean I could I guess I could just leave it you know right there oh maybe some flowers like black flowers on top that could be cute I'm not sure honestly leave me comments let me know what you guys think next pumpkins I am a pumpkin freak my husband gets so mad because whenever Halloween comes around I always get like a thousand pumpkins and I buy more every year but that's okay because I feel like in fall you can never have too many pumpkins and you can put them everywhere and they're just so cute and they're such a mood and these ones that i got these are some smaller ones because i'm actually not quite sure where i'm gonna put them yet i'm kind of thinking i might put them on the bar so they have to be a little bit smaller if they're gonna go up there so the first one that i got is this super cute pearlescent one it has like if you can see I just love this one and this one was $7.99 and this was at home goods and they have so many to choose from so many different colors and vibes and next one that I got I could not say no to I saw it and uh, like I just had to have it because it was so me and that is this pink one but it's frosted and glass and it lights up so I saw this one and I had to have it so you can see it lights up it has little twinkle lights inside it has a little um, on off switch at the bottom so yes this one is adorable I had to have it this one I think I actually might keep here in my beauty room because you know you guys know that the theme is pink and pastel and whatnot in here and I do actually have some pumpkins from last year that I'm gonna put up again and they are pastel colors. I have a little lavender one, white ones. I wanna say I have a teal one that's like pastel color. So if you guys wanna see a fall decor room tour, I can do that too because I do like to decorate my shelves and everything. I'm a festive girl. That's just what it is. But the next pumpkin that I got is this 
heirloom style pumpkin and it's white my favorite color look at how adorable that is i love when they look all wonky like that it's just super adorable oh i forgot to tell you guys the price on this one this one was $9.99 and I do have some more that are actually right behind me in here I haven't brought them out yet obviously because I haven't started decorating yet like I said but I have some really cute ones that I picked up last year from Marshalls and they are super gorgeous I actually think we might have broken some along the way and there were some super gorgeous ones that I got last year from Marshalls so I'm gonna have to take inventory when I start pulling out all my fall stuff and actually setting out and seeing what I have I want to say the one that I'm thinking of, gorgeous one, I think it might have broke last year, but I'm not positive. I have to go on my Instagram because I did Instagram a pic last year. I had it up here with all my pink perfumes and everything, and it was, it was so cute. But yeah, so anyway, this one, the white one, $4.99, like what a deal. I'm actually thinking these two I might put on like a candle holder and this one actually is kind of reminding me of a couple ones that I saw on a Pottery Barn ad which you guys know Pottery Barn is like super duper expensive but yeah like just these three together they just look so good the colors and actually when I was shopping I had them in the cart I was trying not to take up too much room so I had the pumpkins in here and they actually didn't look too bad. I don't know if you guys can see. So like maybe I'll put some pumpkins in here. That could be cute. I'm not sure yet. So next, it's just a simple little jar that I got. I already do have a jar that I keep out there, which I did have marshmallows in because they were. it just looks super cute with marshmallows in it. But seeing that it's fall now, I did switch out the marshmallows. Or to be honest, I didn't switch them out. My daughter ate all of them because she's two. I mean, come on. Um, but yeah, so I did replace them with candy corn and they look super cute up there on my coffee bar. Um, but this one I got to fill up. I'm not sure what I'm gonna put in here. I don't know if you guys follow her YouTube name is Sparkly Blonde One, and she has super cute content. She does a lot of fall decor and like shop with me type videos and so I, I don't know if it was last year or a couple years ago she put some of those little ghost peeps the ghost shaped peeps in a jar and it just looked super cute so I think I might do that I haven't been able to find them yet because a lot of the stores don't have their fall stuff out yet or like Halloween candy so I'm waiting on that or I might put those little the pumpkin candies or maybe I'm not sure I have to wait until all the Halloween candy comes out um, but I think I want to put some candy in here and put it you know on my coffee bar that would be really cute okay and so the next thing that I got was pumpkin spice skinny syrup and that is gonna be for my morning coffee because like I said 10,000 times before I am festive so even when I drink my coffee I like it to be festive I haven't um, actually tried this yet but um, I think it says let's see steam I can't do a latte because I don't have steamed milk I mean I guess I could get one of those like steamer things but I'm not gonna do that to be honest um, I'll probably I don't know I'm not really seeing um, some instructions other than for a pumpkin spice latte but I don't know I'll figure it out and if you guys want to know how it is I will let you know after I try it because I haven't even opened this yet I was waiting to show you guys my little haul so um, yeah I'm gonna and it's a limited edition of course because this is a little look at the picture how festive so yeah I'm gonna try this out also pick this up from home goods all of this stuff is from home goods we will be trying that very soon and then the last thing that I got is not really fall um, oriented but I did pick it up from home goods and I really like it a lot and I'm gonna show you guys and that is this thing right here it's like a giant calendar that uh, let's see 
can show you guys. You guys know what a calendar looks like, but I have been trying to get organized lately. So it has this little section that you can do a to-do list on, and then a little section down at the bottom, if you guys can see, where you can write little notes, which I think I'm gonna um, write little love notes for my family so they can read it. But I really got it because, um, Anyway, so I really got it because, get comfortable again. I got it because me, my family and I are starting to eat at home more just because it's more cost effective and we're kind of a big family. We're a family of five, so it just, it makes more sense for us to eat at home and you know, save a couple extra coins. So being the mom and you know, the organizer of the family, I'm the one that has to make the menu and everything and you know make the grocery list and all of that and I do work nights on Thursday Fridays and Saturdays so I'm not here to tell my husband what's for dinner I mean of course I can text him and stuff and remind him but it would be a lot easier if I could just write it on the calendar and then he can see it on the wall like oh Monday we're having lasagna Tuesday we're having uh, pizza Wednesday we're having tacos you know it would just make it a lot easier and then you know, nobody has to sit here and say, oh, what are we having for dinner tonight? I just, I think that would be a lot easier. And if I have you guys on Snapchat, and if I don't, my name is Courtney Cotton Candy, and that's C-O-U-R-T-N-E-Y, C-T-N-C-N-D-Y. That's my Snapchat name, go add me. Um, but yeah, so if you have me on Snapchat, you probably saw that um, not too long ago I was I'm so out of breath from picking up that thing. Ugh. Anyway, so if you have me on Snapchat, you uh, might have saw that I was kind of getting into writing to-do lists because I'm the type, when I write something down, it helps me to remember a lot better. So I think that day I wrote down a to-do list on a just a regular piece of paper and I posted it up on one of our bulletin boards and I kept seeing it, so it actually helped me. I got everything done that was on that to-do list and it kept me on track, so that was really good. So the for me, the fact that it has this calendar on it and it also has the section where I can write the to-do list where I will see it every day and plus I can erase it and I won't have to be going through paper and everything, I think it's a really good idea and I think it was, yeah, it's something that I'm gonna get a lot of use out of, so. Yeah, that is the last thing that I got. I'm seriously trying to catch my breath. <laughs> oh, anyway, that is it for this haul, you guys. Um, yeah, leave me comments down below. Anything um, you want to say, interact with me. I'd love to hear it. Uh, if you guys have any suggestions on what I can put in this bowl, please let me know. And as soon as I get my home decorated for fall, I will give you guys a little tour and show you guys everything that I put up. So that's gonna be it for now, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.